I really don't think Shining Armor has the full story. I think you all need something other than a stallion's perspective. What are you talking about? My version so far has intrigue, drama, unrequited love, my emotional suffering. An exploding polo mallet? <laughs> Geeks! When are we going to get to the part about the party? Let's see. Your plan to win me over was to talk to me, get the attention of the school to become fall formal king, and profess your love as we dance the night away? Yes, it was a good plan. And is that what happened? Well, no. Then let me finish the story. So, you still went to the dance with that bug withers? I did, but I didn't leave with him. Well, what happened? Details! Oh, did Shining Armor sweep you off your wings? Was it romantic? Was he a complete dork? Hey! <laughs> All three. And Twilight, you should know better. Thank you for coming to my defense, my sweet. He's always a bit of a dork. <laughs> I think I'll start at the night I full set Twilight Sparkle. You mean the night of my exceptional flugelhorn recital? Let her tell her story, Shiny. You keep that up, and I'll let everyone know Mom's nickname for you. You wouldn't dare. Ahem. As I said, I'll start with that night. You remember Twilight Sparkle? Now we'll be a little late. Shiny will want to go out for ice cream after the recital, or he'll get all cranky wanky. Very cranky wanky. <laughs> Hello! Smith. Could he be any more adorable? Miss Cadence. Okay, Twilight Sparkle. First off, I need you to tell me absolutely every relevant piece of information you have about your brother. Then, we'll make cookies and have the best night ever. Agreed? Oh, oh okay. Wait. What? Oh! I get it. You like him. You think he's cute. Well, I... Yes. Will you help me? That depends. Are you ready to take extensive notes of his likes and dislikes? To create several comparative charts about your popularity versus his? Do you bring a label maker? Is your paper white rule or academy rule? I have 37 different colors of paper for my label maker. I always have an abacus with me just in case I need to calculate percentages for a pie chart. White rule paper is for foes. Let's do this. Cadence, I think you and I are gonna get along very well. That's it! We're perfect for each other! I'm going to make Shiny Armor my very special sun pony! All the data we've collected seems to point to a happily ever after. Twilight, I need you to swear on a stack of color-coordinated index cards that you will never tell Shiny Armor about tonight. I swear. Would you take the full school playground oath not to tell? Sunshine, sunshine, ladybugs awake. Clap your hoofs and bake a cake. If I do lie and spill the beans, you can make me eat sardines. Bonding! <laughs> what? Twilight? Do you realize how much easier my life would have been if he had told me all of that? Excuse me, the playground elf is an unbreakable vow. Even you should remember that. Yeah! And then at the parade. Oh no, Buck. Please don't. I have, um, just did my hair. Don't want to muss it, you know? I do know. It takes forever to get my feathering just right. You really get me, Cadence. <sighs> You know, Cadence, I'm planning on making every goal at the polo match just for you. Who the hell is that? What the? Heh, <laughs> no way that stun work. I'm the only one going to be fall for my king. Geek. Geeks? What a bunch of geeks! <laughs> that, that was so mean. How could you? What? I'm just having a laugh. <laughs> You're still coming to the polo match, right? How awful. How could you still go to the dance with him after that? Yeah, how could you? Well, right before he asked me after the polo game, I was going to try and find you. I'm just going to find Shining Armor and ask him to the dance myself. I think I saw him on the sidelines earlier. I wonder why he was wearing a black turtleneck. <laughs> 
What do you think of Shining Armor on the float earlier? I never noticed how cute he is. I wonder if he has a date for the dance. My brother is a friend of his. I think I overheard them talking about some pony he already likes. He's asking her. Too bad, I have gone with him. Already likes? Some pony? No, it can't be. Cadence, how do you like to go to the fall funeral with me? Of course she'll go with you. No one else has asked her. Well, I guess it's true no pony has asked me yet. I was kind of hoping one pony would. Right, you were waiting for me. Well, I... I'll pick you up at eight. You're so lucky. He's so cute. And popular. Do you think he has a brother? Oh dear. But the list, the charts, were perfect for each other. Shining armor can't like something else. You're so lucky, Cadence. Bug is the most popular stallion in the academy. Lemony Gems, don't you think he's kind of mean? My mom always tells me personality traits you don't like in a stallion can be fixed with constant nagging. Right, Diamond Rose? Of course. How else do you deal with boys? They're impossible. How about this dress? It matches Buck's cutie mark. Do you think like on stallions they should call them cutie marks? How about manly marks? Or macho marks? Or... Girls, I have a confession to make. I don't want to go to the fall formal with Buck. <gasps> but... but he's so cute! And the captain of the polo chain. I know, but he's not for me. I like shining armor. He's my pick for my very special sun pony. Well, what? Cadence, you're a beautiful princess. You can have any pony. Are you sure you want to waste that fortuity on shining armor? Of all ponies? Who's next? His friend with the bow tie? I can kind of see it. He's cute, but not that cute. Shouldn't you think on this? Maybe sleep on it? No, it's him, or no pony. We are going to live happily ever after in a crystal palace. I can feel it. Look at it this way. With Buck back on the market, one of you can have him. Shining armor it is! We'll do everything we can to get you two together. I knew you'd come around. Okay, here's how tonight is going to go down. Shining Armor is going to go to the dance. We're going to be there as a distraction. Except you, Poindexter. You will be out front with Shining Armor. Doing what? I don't have a date. Yes, you do. What? We failed miserably at trying to get Shining Armor on the ballot for Four Funnel King. That's out. We are going to do everything we can to get Buck to reveal his true colors to Cadence. He's a jerk. It won't be too hard. It's the simplest thing in the world, you dumb buck. And then, 8-Bit will swoop down from a rope on the rafters and poke Buck when he isn't looking, further irritating him. Let him escort you into the dance, then tell him you weren't interested. Why can't I send him a note now and tell him I don't want to go with him? Why wait? This is a courtesy to me. I will be at the dance, waiting to console him, of course. Or may. I can console just as well as you. Ahem. <clears throat> While well, one of us is mending Buck's broken pride, you just walk up to Shining Armor and ask him to the dance. Easy. What if he's at the dance of another pony? I overheard he might ask some pony. Please, like any pony can hold a candle to you. You're amazing. And your paperwork says you're perfect match. Whatever pony he brings will just need to step aside. All fairs in love and war. And then, after Buck discovers that 8-Bit is in charge of the state, and Gaffer is behind the itching powder and the whoopee cushion, he'll run off after them. This leads me to dance with Cadence and ask her to be my very special son pony. What am I doing again? We haven't gotten to that. You'll know soon enough. And we're ready. Hey, we still have like three hours before we have to be at the dance. Want to play a quick round of Hocus Pocus to get together? Sure, deal the cards. Thanks for the sour prosamons, Buster. And we're ready to get you to your dream stallion. I think there's a wrap. 
Shall we get dressed? Ready in only three hours? Oh gosh, we need to hurry. Hey, hand me a bobby pin! I need a bobby pin! I keep my health secure! My life is over! Cadence, you look lovely. Are you looking forward to tonight? Well, not really. But I'm hoping to change that. In all honesty, there's somebody else I'd rather be going with. He'll be there tonight. Now, Cadence, it's important to fulfill our obligations. If you agree to go with a young stallion, it's the right thing to do, to go and be gracious. Go, have fun, leave the dance as friends. Princess Celestia, Buck Withers is here to escort Princess Cadence to the dance. Wonderful. Show him in. I'd like to meet. Hello, Princess Celestia. Can I call you Celestia? We're practically family now that I'm dating the fair Cadence. Wow, Canterlaw Castle. I could get used to living here. Maybe after graduation, there will be wedding bells. Lucky you. Let's go, Cadence. Mustn't be late for our first public appearance as Canterlot's newest celebrity couple. Ditch him the first chance you get. <laughs> oh, my shiny whiny, so handsome, handsome. It's too bad your date couldn't come here for photos. Yup, too bad. Shiny armor. I overheard some of what you're planning and I just want to say good luck. Kenan's is really great. I'm sure she likes you too. Thanks, Twily. <laughs> I'm so nervous. I could really use some insider information about now. Yeah, I'm sure you could. And then this summer, my mommy dearest would just love to have you out on our air balloon. She was simply thrilled when I told her we were going to the dance together. She and father would just... Can you believe my aptitude test say I should be a teacher? Grody! Mine say politician, as if. Don't worry, you look like a pretty princess. Well, I do feel pretty. Is that Point Dexter in a dress? Does Point Dexter have a sister? That is Point Dexter. Shining Armor isn't here with any pony. I'm free and clear. <laughs> She looks lovely. Well, back to what I was saying. Daddy will want you over for a tour of my trophy room now that we're... Listen, Buck. Yes, Pookie? It was really nice of you to bring me here tonight, but I need to be honest with you. I, um, really just... I just don't deserve a guy like you. Let's just be friends, okay? But, but, why? Can I get you some punch, Buck? How about a dance? A quick step? Samba? Foxtrot? Moonwalk? The time warp? Wait a minute. Oh, I don't think so. That nerd is getting a piece of my mind and huff through his face. Well, he's not taking this well. Wanna go see if any of the steeplechase team wants to dance? Sure. Hello, Shining Armor. Huh? A dark warp? I think by the end of the night, we'll be able to work you all the way up to coherent sentences. Uh-huh. Cadence, I need to talk to you right now. Whoa, what? God. Oh, come on! You look very nice, Poindexter. No pony has told me why I'm in a dress yet. Because you never gave Gaffer back his replica ballast sword after Nightmare Night last year, and that stallion holds a grudge. Consider yourself punished. I still feel pretty. He can't take that away from me. Cadence, I want to have a few words with you. Buck, what happened to you? What happened to me? That dweeb's friends happened to me. What? Never. Every pony, it's time to announce the king and queen of the fall formal. I think it's no surprise that our queen this year is Princess Cadence. Go on and get your crown, princess. I bet it'll look beautiful on you. Do you think for one second that she will pick you over me? You're a dweeb. I'm Buck Withers. I'm a star at this academy. I- And for our king, again, no surprises here. 
the fall from a king is back with us. You're not good enough for her shining armor. You never will be. I'm the one who deserves a happily ever after, not you. And every pony in this ballroom thinks so. Ha! Congratulations, you arrogant little. Now for our dance. I don't think you're the one who deserves the happily ever after. Who said that? I did. Shining Armor is one of the good ponies. You're nothing but a jerk. And he's the best Paladin any ogre gets an ogre's dude could want. Maybe not right now with that. Yeah? Well, you're just his wussy friends and no pony else here agrees with you. Shining Armor volunteered to tutor me in math. Bag stole my lunch money after fall school. Shining Armor walks my little brother home from school. Bug shoved me in a locker. I was there for days. Who cares about being nice when you're great looking, rich, and good at sports? I do. And I want nothing more than for Shining Armor to be my very special sun pony. Cadence, I'm Buck Withers. I'm Polo Captain. I, I have amazing cheekbones. Think about what you're saying. It's over, Buck. Go home. No, this is not over. Cadence, hold on just one minute. Think about... Goodbye, Buck. What are you doing? Let me out of this right now. My father is the Congress pony. How do you feel about Crystal Palaces? How about we get through our first dance first? Then we'll talk palaces. Can I take the dress off now? Do you have my bath with you? No. Then no. Okay, I got them together. Why haven't I leaped, El? And we lived happily ever after. Let's not use the past tense when saying that. It sounds ominous. How about we are living happily forevermore? Or living blissfully in the moment? Existing in the state of perpetual happiness. Whatever happened to Bug? Surely he wasn't as bad as you make him sound. He got better when he got older. He's a nicer guy nowadays. This way, my little honey bunches. Let me pull out a chair for you. Oh my, 